Well, Heaton's was um, established by a chap called Reuben Heaton uh, back in 1857, um, and the main manufacturing was centred around fishing reels. And around the 1930s, early 1930s, the, the first scales appeared in terms of the dial format. Here is a specimen hunter, uh, and you can see around the outside edge here we've got the light reactive layer which we've developed. What we're looking here is to improve uh, readability of the scale, improve visibility, uh, and in particular to improve visibility in different light levels. So in low light levels, for example, this ink will enhance the numbers and the divisions that are printed on the dial. In higher light levels, it will provide a matte background. It allows the eyes to focus. And so what we've done is we've transferred that to the new quarter scale. This is the uh, Mark I uh, sample, which is, is fresh off the production line at the moment. We are now going to do some um, tests on this. Once we feel we've got the, the ink levels right, then we'll sign off on that and these will go into production. The original mission statement from the founder uh, of the company was that a good name is better than riches. We use the same codes of practice, if you like, that, that, uh, that are in place and, and govern the commercial scale manufacture. So the, the fishing scales benefit from, from that and are calibrated to a level, um, technically speaking, in excess of, of the requirement for this class of product. And we have essentially developed the reputation on the back of that um, manufacturing process. Okay, well, just a small uh, window into the calibration here. And we're, this is where a lot of the specimen hunter level products are hand calibrated. Um, in order to get the resolution across the range that we're looking for. Um, this is a progression, if you like. It looks a little bit hands-on, it looks a little bit old-fashioned, but what it does do is it allows the guys that are calibrating to get a feel of the, of the profile of the scale, to, to balance out the, the, the um, calibration on first and second revolution, uh, and to make sure that the product is within tolerance over the complete range. The collaboration between uh, Reuben Heaton and Corda originally came about through uh, friendship, uh, I guess. We were doing the rounds back in the day, all the, all the carp shows, um, carp society shows and what have you. And it was purely a conversation between myself and, and Danny uh, originally um, about whether a, co a collaboration would be possible. Uh, and that was back in 2005. So we've come a long way since then. We don't just make scales for anybody. We, we, we make scales for, for those brands that, that we feel have a, a similar ethos to ourselves in terms of manufacture and, and products. And um, it's been a fantastic collaboration ever since. Obviously with the anniversary, uh, we have an exciting project with a specimen hunter base. I think that probably reflects the relationship between the two companies in terms of of what we've done in the past and what we're looking to do in the, in the future. These are the um, scales that we use for the manufacture of the commercial market scales. Um, so I can just show you these in action. In principle, we are taking the certified weights here and we are the, the machine allows these to fall away so we can apply um, weights one after another up to, up to a maximum tolerance. So in terms of a principle, we will drop the table away, it allows us to record a weight and also to monitor the balancing of the, of the scale. So here we see 12 kilo weight on, on a 50 kilo scale. So theoretically, the more weight we apply, um, we can look at the uh, performance of the scale over the, across the range and we can see where the inaccuracies are, where, where we're out of tolerance, where we're in a tolerance and we can adjust the springs inside the scale accordingly to, to balance that out. Uh, and this is the process that we use for the current quarter scale, the carpy green scale, and it's the same system that we use for all the commercial scales which we calibrate to the required EN standards. So the quarter um, 
anniversary scale is, is pretty unique in terms of it's the first time we've used the Specimen Hunter Dual Revolution base to manufacture uh, an own brand model for, for, for any brand at all. So this is a first in, in many respects. Uh, and with it being a, a limited edition product as well, uh, it's going to be you know, quite an exclusive bit of kit.